all these damn mosquitoes in Texas, y'all. Listen, we're gonna walk you step by step what pillow's best, how each pillow should be used, how to train your dogs on the pillow, and how to keep your dog motivated. Now, I can't sell you motivation. I ain't gonna lie to you about that because some of y'all couldn't get your dog to do nothing, and that's not my problem. But if you do have the problem I have with having a dog who is driven like a psychopath, you see, what was that? Uh, oh, man. Hey, don't stay dog, man. <laughs> Stan's gonna break it down. I'm about to do my little spring pole thing. Hey, this rope right here, you get a little stool or a chair. When I tell you, time saver, Ego and Tron will hang in this tree for half a day. And where'd they get that rope at? What this? Amazon. Amazon. Amazon, people. God's gift to us is Amazon. And is it a dog training tool or? A... Oh, uh, no. No, I wouldn't train no dog on it. You gotta have a dog that's trained and then go from there. <laughs> So in this case, they a little train, just a little bit now. Just a little train, not a lot. It's a wee bit. You got weight, you got weight. Try to sound like Patty the Bill over there. If anybody know Patty, tag her in this. <laughs> Patty, what you said this bitch with Gorilla Glue? <laughs> now that was, a, that was a thing. Hey, you know what? You guys don't know this and I ain't never bought another patty pie. This is a true story. Never bought another patty pie. I'm disappointed. You know that great value makes the patty pie? Did, did you know that? <laughs> you saw that? He yeah, I saw the video, good. but they good. They good? But Patty got, she get, they made 200 million, she got 20 million. And great value. I mean, the great value pie. I'm over it. But it is good, I ain't gonna lie to you. Go get you a patty pie. <laughs> support. Wait, boy, boy. You got wait, wait, boy. Support, support, support. But I'm telling you, I'm over I'm so tight, bro. Oh, I'm so tough. So get this. We brought Ego out. As you see, go ahead and give him a perspective. <laughs> see, I'm ready to work, boy. <laughs> He's not all there, people. There's this lunatic gene that's somewhere in there and he just goes somewhere else. But we've got advanced level two. So if you want to go level two, make the dog work a little bit more, this right here is a nice wedge and it's, it's well put together. Hey, did we see them at Pet Global? No. Oh, we didn't see them there, but we saw one that we were like, yo, that's tough. Mm -hmm. Now I lowered it for Ego because he ain't got them hops like Tron. Matter of fact, I'll show you. We gonna let it off real quick. Watch, right, right. <laughs> I'll show you, hey, he be jumping like a fat dude. No disrespect <laughs> to all people uh, of all sizes. <laughs> Take care of yourself. Take care of yourself. Hey, get out there and get a gym. Hey, you know what? They built a vodka off skinny vodka. You would feel bad if it was fat vodka. True. You'd be like, damn, I gotta buy this fat vodka. I ain't about to buy no fat vodka. That'd be like somebody, you just don't want, you don't do it. I'm lying. Are you ready? Hold on. Working with a monster. Working with a monster. Let's go, let him off. Here's a go, boy. Go get him. Shoot. Uh -huh. Oh. Ooh. Barely, boy. That's a pool bite. Uh huh. That's a pool bite. You that's go. Okay. No, no, no. Make him come up. Make him come up. Cause he got to think about it now. Yeah, work. What you see is more effort. I was gonna help you out, but now. Nah. No, no. Look, he got to come off of it. Now this is advanced level two. Now stay and walk them through why this is a more difficult wedge to use, or why this is advanced. Uh, because it does have that wedge in it. It doesn't have a lot of give. So if he doesn't bite hard and hold, he ain't gonna be able to get it. <laughs> And it makes him have to open his mouth. So you see how the wedge is shaped. <laughs> and when he's trying to get up there, if he ever got it, it would fit perfectly in his mouth. And that's what you're wanting. <laughs> he's a fat dude, he's a fat dude. Uh, that man. Lower twist. <laughs> oh, no, make him get it. He got it, he got it, he got it. He got to work. He don't get it. He's going to be right. jumping and go to sleep. All right, you can. Come on, let's go. Oh! Come on, E. He right there, too. It's a game of inches, Ego. No, he's smart, though, because at some point, he's going to sit there and take a break. And then he's going to pause and think about it. <laughs> See? Yep. Say, wait, hold on. Somebody help me, help me out. Help me, please. Help me, please. Help me, help me, please. <laughs> he ain't got no 
got no hops, boy. It's okay. And if your dog is not built for this, don't do this. Do not start your dog off like this. Ego has been doing this. How old is he? Almost three now. Yeah, yeah. Three and two. And he's been doing it for almost three years. So this is the, not the first time because you can discourage your dog. If your dog doesn't have motivation to go up for things like this and they keep jumping and missing, you can discourage the dog. Yeah. But a dog like this, he ain't finna stop until he get it. No. Now what we're gonna do while Ego's in the tree is walk you through each level here in a second. I'm gonna go ahead and lower for this bozo. He, hey, he's slick. <laughs> He gonna try to jump off me. Parkour. And I have three, three, three nails. <laughs> you want me to hold him? Yeah, yeah. yeah <laughs> He go digging. He go digging. <laughs> there you go. You gonna get that. You gonna get that. When you see Ego jump on there, he's he's angry now. <laughs> he's like, he gonna be there for a while. This pillow. There we go. What's the first pillow, man? So, this is more of a puppy pillow. It's very thin. You can see it. So, it's going to be a nice, easy bite for them. They don't have to open their mouth very wide. So, in this case, size matters. <laughs> <laughs> All the time, the size matters. <laughs> <laughs> so, yes. Yeah, so, I would start puppies or in inexperienced dogs with something like this. This is another basically kind of puppy, but it's going to have a different material. So, these two would be the puppy introductory. The next one we move to is going to be a bigger bite, but it's still soft. So they can get it, bite wow. hard, but they are going to open their mouth a little wider. Each one of these pillows, it gets more, oh, that is soft. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. And that just builds courage. They get more and more experience, per se, yeah. biting uh, a more complicated pillow, per se. And it's just like raising the weight when you're doing curls. You start with 10s, go up to 15s, you're going to get a little bit stronger whenever you're using this stuff. This is going to be a bigger wedge, but this is a lot softer than that. So again, he's gonna have to open his mouth wider, but it's still soft, so they don't have to bite super hard to hold on to these. These two here have these leather materials, so it's wide, but it's also soft as well. But if they don't get a good bite, like you see, they started ripping it up, they were biting so hard. Mm -hmm. But a young, experienced dog, they'll get on there and slide right off, slide right off. It's gonna teach them to bite so and hold. What actually does encourage a dog to bite hard then? I think them losing a couple times. Yeah. So when they start getting up to the higher levels, with these wedges and these pillows now this one here that's hard it's not hard anymore because they broke it in but if you feel the size up here that's tough that's a chinese finger trap on steroids so they got to open their mouth wide hold on and that's going to motivate them to bite harder the wedge as well open oh. his mouth wide and this has been really broken Bro, in. that this joke has been just <laughs> This is a, had better days, had better days, people. But again, start your dog off slow, build their confidence up, make them motivated to want to do these things. And one thing you can do is at the end of the session, tease them up, tease them up, tease them up, put them up. There you so go. they're going to be thinking about it. Dang, why didn't I get that bite? So next time they grab it, like Ego, he missed a couple of times. Now he's going to be on there for a while. And he ain't came off that pillow since we've been talking. Ever long you saw him get on there to now, he been on that people and this joker, if it's not, if it, even if the sun's out, he will hang in that tree for about 30, 45 minutes. At some point, I'm like, yo, we gotta get him off here, man. We, we gotta go home. <laughs> we gotta go home at some point. This is awful. Mm -hmm. And then you always wanna be paying attention to your dog as well. We had Tron out earlier and he started looking a little loopy because hey. he was working hard. We stopped. Hey, Tron eyeballs on they was rolling back his head. He like, this, you know, like oh, yeah, we gotta put him up, bro. Put that drunk up, boy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so the advanced level, which is what they saw in the last episode, yeah. this is this is when you go uh, Kratos. <laughs> when you about to go God mode in Fortnite, that lightning get in your hands, and you raise up, you're like, oh, let him out. <laughs> so let's take him, let's take that off and see what Ego does on this. Oh snap! Oh, shook it, shook it. Stay tuned. Out. You're disgusting. I put this on just for you. Oh! Oh, in the oh. air! In the air! That's a wet willy! <laughs> oh, oh no! Oh no! Who seen something about Mary? Look at that! When he whacked off and in his hair. <laughs> something oh, about Mary? Yeah. I ain't about that like. Ooh, it's in your beard. Oh! <laughs> You know, life sucks when you're in first person. Can't even see yourself. Somebody got to tell you. And then they don't tell you. They be like, hey, buddy. Like, do you know you got like a big ass booger in your face? you like this. If somebody, you get to that 15 person, they be like, hey, my man. Like, I just want to let you know Pluto in your nose. 
these boogers all day. Hey, no, I was watching. Watch watch somebody told me it's talk to ten people. <laughs> ten people. <laughs> but, hey, bro. Uh, I don't know if it just happened, but uh, you got some up like, there. I didn't even touch my nose with ten people. <laughs> <laughs> My nose is yesterday, nigga. Oh, no. Hold on, hold on. Let me get in this one. Come on. Hey. Whoa. What are you doing? Oh! Hey. <laughs> Not the handle. <laughs> Drop it. <laughs> Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. And I don't think that saliva is helping either. There, there we go. go. Woo! Once he figured it out, oh, look, he's slipping up. He's he's slipping up. He missed that face, boy. What he? It's a full mouth bite. And he's holding on. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Oh, there you go. There you go. I like seeing this, man. <laughs> you don't you don't find motivated bullies like this too often. <laughs> Not with the leather pillow. Mm -mm. That's a hard biting dog right there, boy. <laughs> I want to see it again. Get him off. I want to see it again. Do it again, Ego. Do it again. He going to come off. He got to. And let them make any work work. Good boy, man. Let's go. Work, E. Come on, E. He's like, I like, almost feel the ground. That's 80. That's crazy. The dogs hold themselves up with their little mouths. Mm. I didn't catch his breath with him. Yeah, buddy. You better calm down. That's it. All right, people. Let's go. Oh, three. <laughs> Nico's usually holding on to these pillows for about 30, 45 minutes. He's been out here for 10. <laughs> this is a workout. <laughs> this is a good workout, people. This is pure leather. Look, but this making it work. I love this. I'm going to have to give me a couple of these. This is the one. This is the website. Yeah, E. Mm -hmm. Make you put a smith in it, boy. Mm -hmm. I'm going to double, double strap it. I'm trying to go to the head. Look at all that slobber. So, people, let me tell you this. I know Ego pretty well. We're getting to that final phase and having to put him up. Leather pillow making him do a lot more work than he want to, but that's the beauty of it. And as uh, Stan said, don't come out here with your dog if your dog in condition to do this stuff, man. You'll kill your dog literally. You will definitely kill it. And he's getting there. Okay. He starts thinking about it. He got the snot coming out of his jaw. Look at that snot. <laughs> that's just. And you hear that sound? That palate change? He ain't got no soft palate, people. He wore out. Still got heart. That's it. As he comes out this time, we'll leash him, put him up, and say, that's enough, buddy. You done good, son. <laughs> you did good, pig. Guys, he walks you through every phase of building confidence, courage, consistency, and uh, determination in your dog. Now, what we didn't show you is start to finish. So maybe with our next round of puppies, we'll show you how this should work. Guys, take care of your dogs. Oh. <laughs>